Hey, welcome to Story Door Studio. Got a beautiful day outside. Figured it'd be a nice time to uh, take, a, take a couple minutes and talk about wood finishing. Uh, you know, the finish on wood is not just a beautiful thing that we like to bring out and enhance the grain of wood. But it also has very, uh, you know, obviously we want some extremely effective protective qualities for the door that, you, that we make. So... I do. I did a finish test because the last couple of weeks we had terrible weather leading up to today. Anywhere from freezing to 50 degrees and rain pretty much the entire time, 100% humidity outside. So I took that opportunity to finish two pieces of wood, 16th of an inch thick, but all in grain. Uh, in grain pretty much acts as a sponge for, for moisture in wood. Uh, so I knew that if I painted both sides, not paint, but if I if I brush both sides with this protective finish, I was going to be able to tell whether or not the finish was effective in blocking out that moisture uh, in the wood and keeping it from warping. And what's happened is this piece on the left I cut the same day, and uh, it had no finish on it. Well, as you can tell, the piece on the left has cupped and twisted. You can kind of see there how that's happened. The piece on the right, nice and flat. It's perfect, actually. Um, sixteenth of an inch thick piece. Like I said, extremely susceptible normally to any sort of moisture. But this finish that I'm using on these doors these days, I think I've found a new favorite. Very protective and uh, really beautiful. Of course, this hasn't been sanded or anything, but you can at least see, still see some saw marks on there. However, it's a nice satin finish, and I kind of like a satin finish because you can still, um, you can still kind of, you, you can still feel the wood. It's not like touching plastic like a polyurethane might, might give you that sort of quality. Anyway, thanks very much. I'm better with my muscles than I am with my mouth. I work the fairgrounds in the summer Or go pick fruit down south And when I feel them chilly with